Swishers, let's take a quick recap today of game one of the finals. First off, how many of y'all actually predicted it would be Chicago and Phoenix? Or did you think it would be Vegas and Connecticut? Well, however you predicted, it's still a great showdown between these two teams. Let's start with Kalia Copper and how unstoppable she has been throughout the whole entire playoffs. Not one person has been able to find a way to put a stop to her. She's averaging 18.6 points, 5.9 rebounds, and 2.4 assists. So, Phoenix, your biggest worry is going to be Copper. Phoenix also needs Cunningham for sure. You have Kia Nurse who is out with an ACL tear, and so the backcourt has lost a lot of depth for Phoenix. So if Sophie Cunningham can come back by Wednesday, which is predicted she will have a go, then maybe this could help Phoenix a lot because they're going to have to put a stop somehow to Copper. Candace Parker has helped bring in her playoff experience to the team for Chicago, and having that leadership role really brings big energy into the team. Now, Phoenix does have a weak spot right now, and it's their defense. If they can work on defense and stay on copper as much as possible, which can be a little bit hard, if they can do that, they might have a chance to dominate game two. And maybe Tarasi won't be as tired either and she will be able to be ready and come back for sure. So be sure to check out Game 2 on Wednesday, October 13th at 9 o'clock Eastern Time on ESPN. Also, don't forget to join my WNBA Daily Swish Facebook group page, Instagram, and TikTok for all your scores, updates, news, and all things WNBA. Remember, if it ain't hot, it ain't a swish.